Hey neighbors, happy new years. You in the place to be and where that is right here on Miss C's Corner, baby. You seen the title. It's Dollar Tree Hall, okay? It's the beginning of the year, okay? We need some uh, necessities. <laughs> And we got to get right to keep it tight. Okay, this is a brand new year. I'm so excited. So, neighbor, how are y'all doing? If you're watching this, you made it into the new year. So, thank God for that because a lot of people did not make it. Some did not already went home at the beginning of the year. R.I.P. Gangsta Boo. Y'all, I love me some Gangsta Boo. I can't believe she gone, y'all. Like... It make you feel some type of way when the people you you love their music or they inspire you or you just appreciate appreciate them in some kind of way and then they no longer here. It just it, it hurt. It really do hurt. But prayers go out to her family, her friends, all her fans that loved her, her music and the music she made with her the group. But, y'all, it's a new year, and even though getting bad news make you kind of somber, we're going to keep the new year on a high note. We're going to keep it on a high note, and we're going to just make this year the best year of our life because this is the, the year in front of us right now. So, we're going to take full advantage. So, to do that, we had to pick up some things for the house. To get it right. So, have y'all been shopping uh, after the holiday? <laughs> this is what I want to know. I told y'all, all the best shopping is after the holidays, after Christmas, because they have a whole bunch of stuff. They're going to have to mark down because they didn't get rid of it through the holiday season. So, it's time to clean up. But I didn't do that kind of shopping. No. Uh, shopping therapy as of right now. This is just the necessities uh, for the house. So, we were busy a couple of days ago and baby was like, okay, we need some stuff. And I'm like, okay, well, do you boo? Let's go. Let's go get it. So, this is what he picked up when we went to the Dollar Tree Hall. So, let's get into it. The first thing is we picked up two packs of the Harmony toilet paper, soft and strong, two ply toilet tissue for five bucks at Dollar Tree. So yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed y'all New Year's night. What did y'all do? Did you go out? Did you stay in? Did you see it? No. <laughs> If you did, I don't even know. That's your business, okay? That's between you, your guy, and whoever you doing it with or by yourself or whatever you doing, okay? I won't hear Don't you tell me that. Don't you put that down in my comments. Tell me what you was doing there. <laughs> okay? So, um, y'all forgive me, baby. It's Taco Tuesday, and he up in there cooking it up, okay? It smell like a taco real up in here. <laughs> It smells so good and then the seasonings got my nose turned up, okay, and got my belly ready to eat. So whew, it just smells good in here. So if y'all hear me a little, a little nasally, it's because them seasons is percolating in the air. Okay, so we needed another one of these, um, a dish drainer that you put your dishes in after you wash the dishes. Can y'all see that? That was a dollar twenty-five. We had to get another one because the one I have is getting old. Okay, I didn't had it for over five years and it was getting old because I hand washing my dishes. Yes, I use a dishwasher, but when you're from the old school, okay, you use your hands. God bless your hands. You might as well use them. Plus, our dishes don't stay dirty long. As soon as we use them, we clean them. We use them, we clean them. So. We wash them and then let them dry in here. And this is the thing that goes under the drainer, the dish drainer. It's called the um, dish drainer mat. 
it's a black one. It didn't have any more white ones, but it's okay because my kitchen is um black and red anyway. Black and red and brown still fall colors. I need to like redo my kitchen, but it's hard to do that when you buy appliances and everything be matching, everything be cute and perfect, and then you want to go switch up some stuff. Then you get different color pots and all that stuff, but your appliances, like your rice cooker, your uh, air fryer and all that, still the same color, so it throws off everything, so I'm going to have to do something. Any decorators or interior designers, hit your girl up. Let me know something. Come here, you girl. Like. <laughs> Okay, so that is that. I'm putting it back in the bag, y'all, to get it out the way. So, yeah. All right, then we can't leave without a good old bleach lemon scent. Lemon bleach top job from Dollar Tree. So that's for clothes, for cleaning, for putting in your dishwater, whatever you like to use your bleach for. Use it, girl. <laughs> I use it, my dude. Okay, use it. It's good. And I'm sorry if these bags are making a lot of noise. Sometimes. Like on camera after you upload the video, you be like, oh, them bags is making a lot of noise. So if it's hurting your ears, turn down your TV a little bit. Because <laughs> ah, you got that mean to hurt your ears. Uh, but I have got some more clothes um, detergent in Tropical Paradise almond hammer for five bizucks. I went to Aldi's today and they had the Ocean Wave one, which is the blue top one. And it was five dollars and don't give me the line, but it was five dollars and some cents. So you still coming off cheaper going to get it at Dollar Tree. Now if you find it, okay girl, if you find it somewhat cheaper, you know what to do. That's right. Leave it down below. Uh -huh. Because we look south for one another like that. Yes, we do. All this year is love. We sharing love. We giving love. We looking out. We we doing for each other. Because, baby, this world is getting more evil by the day. So, those of us that got good hearts and that wants to see somebody make it besides they self and do good, we got to look out for one another. Because if we don't, who will? So let me get this bag. Y'all. Yeah. Why baby was in the in the in the pantry, girl. In the pantry, D. <laughs> I don't remember if it was in the daytime or the nighttime. Anytime is the right time to get something good to, to eat on, okay? Let me tell you. So he was in there and way, way, way in the back of the cabinet, girl. He found some Kool-Aid packs I bought. <laughs> Some Kool-Aid packs and some, I think it's wires. What, what's the name of them Kool-Aid packs, baby? It's some Kool-Aid packs, girl. So I, we had to get a, a picture to, to make the Kool-Aid. I haven't made no Kool-Aid in so long. What's the name of Okay. I have some of the Kool-Aid. Thank you, baby, for bringing them. Oh. Y'all see that? Your girl got some grape Kool-Aid. Okay? And those y'all didn't know, y'all see that ring on your girl finger? Yes. That's the one. It is what it is now, baby. Yes, okay? If you like it, then he should have put a ring on it. Well, he liked it a lot, and he, he put that ring on it. Okay? So, this is the Kool-Aid, um... Oh, this is the regular Kool-Aid too, but this is the um strawberry one right here, y'all. But Wallers. This one right here. I didn't get this from the Dollar Tree. Um, I'm pretty sure they might have Kool-Aid packs, but I got this from a grocery store like years ago and ain't 
I ain't never used it, y'all. And I got a good old packing back. Um, I uh refurbish like candles when I uh go to Bath and Body Works or somewhere and buy me some candles. I empty the wax out and um and I clean them out and I repurpose the candle holders. So, well, the candle jars. But this all the Kool Aid he found, girl. So. He just sitting here and found all this Kool-Aid. And he talking about, I want some Kool-Aid, baby. I said, well, okay, well, we need a picture. And y'all, he went and got a big old picture, too. You know, this is exactly the one we used to have back in the day. With the little top. <laughs> with this top on it. And then it's open on the other side right there. Man, I just spilled Kool-Aid many days. That jug was heavy, and you thought you had it. Is it spun? Kool-Aid, I don't deflect, okay? Mm-mm-mm. And you was a kid, them, um, them pictures used to be heavy. Hold on, y'all. This lip gloss and this glossy, okay? But yeah, yeah, that's why we bought that. Um, Cause he wants some Kool-Aid. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever he asks for, he can have it. Do you hear me? When once he do this, when a man do this to you right here, when he asks for it, give it to him. <laughs> Make sure. Make sure he's satisfied. So, that's that picture. We also needed some more mouthwash. Now, I don't know why I'm putting all this stuff up on this table. Knowing y'all ain't going to be able to see me in a minute. If I keep putting stuff on the table. I'm going to have to do something with all these bags. So... Next bag, we needed some Ziploc bags, and these are big. It's the Shore Fresh 6 um, refrigerant bags, storage bags. And we use these, or I use them to separate the meat. Like when we go to the meat market and we get packs of meat, or... If we want to just separate family packs of meat we get from the grocery store, depending on how we're going to do it that month or whatever, we can separate the meat, um, clean the meat, and then put it in separate freezer bags and put the dates on it so we can know exactly what we got going on in the deep freezer. Okay? So... This was the, the large bags, the real big bags. So it's only six in there for $1.25. And then these are the smaller bags with the press seal. Like you got to squeeze it until you hear it pop. Okay. The new double zip seal bag. And this, it has 16 in here. 16 gallon bag. Oh my goodness, baby. This thing. It say it can hold 2.5 gallons. Oh, that's really good. Dang. You can put a whole lot, a whole lot up in there. Can't you? And this is a gallon, so let me show y'all this. Y'all see that? And then these other bags. So yeah, if y'all need y'all some big bags, you better hit up the Dollar Tree. Hit up the Dollar Tree is where you need to be. Ow! Y'all better pay me for that Dollar Tree if y'all use my dang song. <laughs> Cause y'all be y'all be looking. These companies be on YouTube. They think they slick. They know they be looking at their folks videos and stuff. Now, y'all, if y'all want to get clean, and I mean squeaky clean, if that ass is a little dirty, <laughs> then this activated charcoal soap is a great soap to use, especially 
after a good workout, you got hot and sweaty, you didn't worked out, or if you have a man, a blue collar worker, man that works outside, this moisturizing bath soap is what you need, baby. This soap is some good soap. It will get you squeaky. Do you hear me? Squeaky clean. Now, ladies, don't put this in or around your yeehaw. Oh, your high. Well, your, your cootie coo, okay? This is not for your cootie coo, okay? But everywhere else on the body, the face, on the arms, everywhere else. Even your bottom is good, but but not the cootie coo. You need uh some something for sensitive skin or or feminine wash or something, okay? And be careful how you clean down there too. You don't need to be digging deep and getting all in there, okay? Because if you get soap, especially any fruity smelling or strong smelling soap with perfumes, you gonna get a yeast infection, okay? And it ain't nice. You gonna be itching. You gonna be burning. You gonna be scratching. Somebody go. People gonna think something wrong with you, okay? You gonna be rubbing up against stuff, trying to get your itch on. It ain't gonna look cute. It ain't gonna, it ain't a good look. It, it's not. So don't you do that, okay? We might have to have a hygiene video later. But yeah, don't do that. But we got three of, uh, ooh, we got three of these of the uh, activated black charcoal because, check, I said charcoal. <laughs> charcoal, soap. <laughs> Y'all know the heck I be. You know I'm country. Y'all know I'm from down south. You know I'm country. Okay? I pronounce my words a little different, but you know what a charcoal, okay? You know what I'm trying to say? So I got three of them because uh, it's beginning of the year. You know everybody had their little uh, New Year's resolutions, okay? And everybody said they're going to be working out and stuff, so we're going to see. So... We gonna we gonna try to go to the gym and work it out, and when we come home and need to take a good old bath, get that old sweat off. We gonna be using this soap, and baby also picked one up in the Eng, uh, English lavender. It says calms and smooths with pure lavender extract, extracts and um, essential oil. So. Mm -hmm. I'm a big lavender person, but sometimes it smells really good, especially in candles. So I'm gonna see. Hopefully, it's a nice, relaxing scent where it can relax me. From what I'm smelling from the box, it got a nice, calming um, scent. So it says calms and smooths. So <laughs> let's see how calm it can get me, okay? That's right. We have some cleaning pads. Some little scrub pads for the kitchen or for the bathroom, wherever you can, uh, wherever you want to use them. Um, you can use them on the counter, on the sink, for the dishes. Okay, and this is just a two pack of the scrub buddies. Okay, let's see what else your girl got. And that's my chair, y'all. <laughs> don't, don't think I'm doing anything uh, inappropriate over here. Inappropriate, inappropriate, you know what I mean. <laughs> Don't judge me, judge yourself. Okay, no, I'm laughing. But I got some uh, fabric softener. Okay, it says uh, 39 small loads. They let you know. But this was $3. Okay. Fabric conditioner. Girl, do you know they was out of downy? I was so mad when I did that other Dollar Tree haul. A couple of weeks ago let's just say last year okay that down I bought it smells so freaking good it smells so good it smells so good so we went back to the Dollar Tree to find some more downing and it was gone like they it was all gone I was mad it was sold out I was like why Every time you find some you love, everybody wanna go and buy it, but it's cool though. So this is what we had to get instead. It'll do for right now until I can go back and get my downy baby because them downies that downy be having your clothes smelling good for about two weeks. 
okay? I smelled the towel yesterday, okay? Getting a new towel, okay? Putting it on the hook, okay? To have fresh towels after we get out the tub. And baby, that towel still was smelling good. You know, when you pick up something fresh and you gotta close your eyes, you know it smells good when you close your eyes. You be all into it. You be all into it. And you clean out four with the purple Fabuloso. If you use Fabuloso, what's your favorite? Purple always been my favorite. Y'all already know how I feel about purple, okay? <laughs> so, I love the purple Fabuloso. You can put this, well, I won't tell you how to clean your house. Clean your house how you clean it, but I use it to clean my floors, but you can also use this in other places to clean, and it will freshen up your house. And I think some people also um, maybe use uh, some of this to do their little potpourri stuff. I don't know. Ask them. <laughs> I don't know how they did it, but I mean, you can use it for different stuff, okay? Just don't put it on your body. Don't nobody put this on your body. Don't put it on your body and keep it away from little kids because it look like juice and little kids will try to drink, okay? Because they don't know the better. So, new parents. Put your stuff, your cleaning products, up and away. If you can't put it up high somewhere, them little suckers climb too. I be on Instagram and Facebook. These little kids these days is, first of all, too damn smart, okay? They smart. How they come out the womb, know how to work the phone and the laptop and the iPads and all this stuff. Lord hammers, okay? And then they, they want stuff and they be climbing up on the cabinets to get to the counter to get on top of the refrigerator get the cereal <laughs> Lord have mercy. to get the cereal baby them kids be loving them some cereal don't they they climb on top of everything to get to the refrigerator to get get the cereal on top I said Lord these kids are so mellow you make you think you make <laughs> Think about it. If you want kids, you gotta have some patience, cause baby, bad, hunty, okay? As these little kids say, I'm looking for other bags, y'all. But um, if, if you don't have no patience, you don't even have no kids. Cause baby, they gonna work, they gonna jump, they gonna jump on your nerves, they gonna roll around on it. They gonna do it. do a backflip on it <laughs> and they gonna do everything to dry you up a high crazy then give you them puppy dog eyes and then do something or say something to warm your heart up then you gonna want to hug them and kiss all of them with their little bad tail oh, these little kids man but anyway yeah my baby picked me up some crests from um Dollar Tree. It smells so good too. It's looking good, baby. I tasted this this far. Ooh, I can't wait. I'm getting hungry now thinking about it. Y'all look, we're gonna make a taco Tuesday. It might be up on Wednesday, but we're making it tonight. Okay, so stay tuned on my other channel, Missy Mukbangs. Okay. So if you're not subscribed, please subscribe to Missy's Corner. And after you're done doing that, go to Missy's Mukbang so you can have tacos with us. Okay, girl.